just playing with this dinosaur toy. <laughs> oh, I sure do love dinosaurs. Do you like dinosaurs? Yeah, they are so cool. Yeah, and it's so cool how all of them look so different from each other. Yeah, whoa. Yeah, dinosaurs used to roam our planet. You know how we know that? Yeah, because people have found fossils. Yeah, fossils of dinosaurs. Isn't that cool? Yeah, fossils are remains from plants and, and animals and dinosaurs from such a long time ago. <laughs> well, I love dinosaurs. You and I are gonna learn about dinosaurs and maybe we'll find some fossils in this video. <laughs> Check it out! Yeah, I have a pail full of sand. Yeah, I found all this sand outside. I think we should use some of our tools to see what's inside the sand, and maybe we'll find a fossil. Yeah, okay, the tools that we have here are a magnifying glass. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, that'll help us look at things nice and up close. Ooh, nice little pick. Yeah. Yeah, a pick and a miniature shovel. So then we can shovel up some of the sand. Ooh, and then check this out. Whoa, it's a brush. <laughs> yep, so then we can be nice and delicate. We definitely don't want to break up the fossils. All right, let's see, what do we have here? Yeah, a bunch of sand. So I think we should take our shovel, our little pick, and then do some picking, okay. Yeah, we need to break it up. Perfect. Yep, now that we're getting it nice and loose. Oh, yeah, I think I might see something. Oh, do you see that? Oh, yeah, I think we found a fossil. Yeah, it's the color gray. Huh, interesting. Whoa, look. Yeah, archaeologists love to do this. Yeah, they're the ones that uncover a lot of fossils. <laughs> Maybe you'll be an archaeologist someday. <laughs> Whoa! Check it out! Yeah, we found all these fossils. And then look right here. Yeah, here's one more. Whoa. To brush it off. Whoa. Check it out. Yeah, it looks like some teeth. Maybe the lower jaw. Whoa, <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, let me empty this. I have to stay nice and clean and organized. Okay, now let's inspect some of these fossils. Whoa, this one is so cool. This one might even be an insect fossil or something. I don't know. Maybe it's some form of type of dinosaur. I don't know. <laughs> this could be any part of the dinosaur, but I don't even know. <laughs> but I know what this is. Yeah. Whoa. This for sure is a fossil. That looks like a rib cage. Do you see it? Yeah. That's a rib cage to a really small dinosaur. Yeah. That's the rib cage. Then the whole dinosaur must have only been about this big. Whoa! Hello! Hey! <laughs> okay, what else do we have here? Whoa. Huh, interesting. This one kind of looks like a rock. <laughs> Who knows? Whoa! Look at this. This looks like an underwater type of dinosaur. Yeah. It's so smooth and shiny. Huh, kind of looks like a, a shell of some sort. I don't know. <laughs> wow, this has been so much fun digging for fossils. Yeah. Whoa, maybe next time you go outside and you find some dirt, yeah, and you have the correct tools, maybe you can dig and maybe you'll find a fossil. <laughs> Whoa, pretty cool. Oh, 
I sure do love digging and brushing for fossils. Whoa! Yeah, I love dinosaurs. Do you like dinosaurs? Yeah, they are so cool. Whoa, check out all these dinosaurs. Whoa! Hey, check it out. Do you know what dinosaur this is? Yeah, this looks like a T-Rex. Yeah, Tyrannosaurus Rex. Whoa, what a scary dinosaur. Yeah, this dinosaur eats meat. Yeah, other dinosaurs. Yeah, that is actually called a carnivore. Yeah, if you are a carnivore, you eat meat. Yeah, and a T-Rex is definitely a carnivore because it has really sharp, big teeth. <laughs> Whoa, check this one out. This is a brontosaurus. Whoa! What a cute dinosaur! Whoa! Look at its long neck! Whoa! Its long neck is really good to reach to the top of the tree canopies. Um, um, and eat a lot of leaves. Yeah, the brontosaurus is an herbivore. Yeah, if you're a dinosaur and you only eat plants, then you would be an herbivore. Yeah like a brontosaurus. T-Rex, carnivore, brontosaurus, herbivore. Whoa! Well, hey, I think we should listen to the dinosaur song, yeah! A long time ago on this planet Earth, before we ever existed, another kind of creature ruled the land. This is a song for them. Dinosaur, Rock! dinosaur, Rock! oh, I love dinosaur, Rock! dinosaur, Rock! dinosaur, Rock! prehistoric dinosaur. Stegosaurus is were bigger than. Triceratops had three horns on their head In case they ever needed to defend The Brachiosaurus had a really long neck And at the end was a itty bitty head Pterodactyls would soar through the sky Their wings were enormous in size And if they stood up straight on the ground They would be as tall Wasn't that dinosaur song awesome? Yeah, 
I love dinosaurs and I love dancing. Didn't that song just make you want to dance? Hey, I have an idea. Why don't you and I pick a dinosaur and let's dance like it? Woohoo! Okay, what dinosaur? Hmm. Oh, yeah. How about a T Rex? Yeah, okay, I'll teach you how to dance like a T Rex. First, you have to put your hands out right here, and they don't have very long arms. So, you just act like you have some claws. Woo! <laughs> and then, you give it a big roar. <laughs> okay, hit that music! Dinosaur. much fun dancing like a dinosaur with you and learning about dinosaurs with you in this video but this is the end of this video but if you want to watch more of my videos all you have to do is search for my name will you spell my name with me B L I P P I Blippi good job <laughs> all right see you again bye bye Hmm, hey, Woo! look at where we are. We are at a beautiful park and look at what we have. Yum, a tasty lunch, like this grape, mm. Mm. this raspberry, mm. Mm. a red strawberry, mm. and we have some vegetables, a sandwich, crackers, but we'll get to this in a little bit. Let's go play first, come on. Wow, this park is so beautiful. Like, these plants, they just look like plants, but they're so beautiful to me. Look, they're so green and alive. And they smell so great. Wow, hey, I'm kinda hungry. Let's go eat some more. <laughs> wow. Huh. Whoa! What happened? Where'd it go? Oh no! My lunch is gone! Hey! Officer! Officer! Oh hey there, Blippi, what's going on? My lunch was just right here. I was eating it and it was so good. And then I went over here and then I looked at some plants and then I came back here and it was all gone. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to investigate this. Lucky for you, I have my crime scene bag with me. Oh. I got a really good idea. Yeah. Do you want to help me, Blippi? I would love to, yeah. Oh, well, I got this special badge just for you. Oh, whoa. Wow, look at that. It even has my name on it. Whoa, I am honored. Whoa! And look at what you rode up on! A police bicycle! Can I look at it? Of course you can, Blippi. Oh, cool. Okay, now look at this. A helmet. Wow, this keeps you nice and safe. Okay, and ooh, look up here. Do you see that? It's a light. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> and the handlebars and one big giant wheel and tire, and then a second big giant wheel and tire. And then we have the pedals and the kickstand. Let's put that up right now. Oh, ooh. yeah, and look at this. This is the crime scene investigation bag, he said. <laughs> this is gonna help us find my lunch, but first, Let's take it for a ride. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. 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 That was so.
so much fun. It is, isn't it, Blippi? Yeah. Well, I think we should get started on the investigation. What do you think? Yeah, I think so too. All right, I think the next best thing, send in the canine. Ooh, canine? That's another word for a dog. <coughs> Officer Feechek, send in the canine. Police dogs have really sensitive noses, and police use those to help us track to people and evidence to help us with our investigations. He did it. He found some evidence. Investigator Blippi, this is the evidence that the canine tracks to. Oh, look! This is my glass! This is my glass that had all the water in it! What's it doing all the way over here? Huh, well, there's the glass, what do we do? Well, we're gonna have to collect the evidence using the bag that we talked about earlier. Okay. So the first thing that we're gonna have to do is put evidence tape up to secure the scene. Okay, Oh, thank you. <laughs> Whoa, look, it says crime scene. Do not cross. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Go around the bumper. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Here you go. That. And we can tie it off. Okay. Uh, let's tie it. There we go. Oh, almost there. Good job, Lippy. Thanks. Okay, it's nice and tied off. Now what? That was a great job, Lippy. Thanks. Now we have to take pictures using a ruler. Okay. Hey, here we go. So we have the ruler. Let's put this down right next to it. Then we have a camera. Let me turn it on. Ooh. <laughs> Smile. <laughs> Oh, you are so beautiful, Glass. <laughs> okay, close up. <laughs> okay, turn that off. And here you go. All right, now that we've taken pictures, we actually have to collect the evidence. Okay. But before we do so, we gotta put gloves on because oh. we don't want your fingerprints being oh, on it. Right. Okay, so we have to put these gloves on. And this first glove is the color blue. And the second glove <laughs> is also the color blue. All right, I got the gloves on, now what? Okay, now that the gloves are on, we can actually pick it up and put it into a bag. Okay. Ooh, look, the evidence bag. Okay, here we go. Pick it up, wow. Ooh, okay, let's put it in the bag. All right. So I got it in the bag, now what? That was a great job. Now we have to get it down to the police department okay. to process it. Okay, so how do we get it there? Well, we're gonna have to call in the motorcycle. Okay. Officer Feedcheck, can you send in the motorcycle for transport of evidence? Okay, I guess I'll go meet the motorcycle. He's over there waiting for you, Blippi. Okay. Oh Whoa, look at what it is. Wow, it's a police motorcycle. And this is what's going to be used to transport the evidence. Here, come here. Wow, look at it. Okay, first things first. Let's put the evidence in the back of this motorcycle. Okay, now it's safe back here. Ooh, and back here, here's a compartment with a laptop. See, there's a laptop. And a printer too. What is this? Oh, look, <laughs> it's a picture for me. Ooh, nice picture. Okay, let's put that down right there. Ooh, okay. Oh, so many cool things to show you. But first, maybe I should hop on. Whoa, whoa, this motorcycle is really big. Way bigger than the average motorcycle. Okay, um, let me show you this. Yeah, kinda wanna show you this first. This is a radar gun. See, this is what's used 
to check the speed of everyone driving on the road. So you should drive the speed limit or lower because that's the limit of safety. Um, let's see, what else can I show you? Oh yeah, the lights! Watch this, ready? Oh yeah, red and blue lights. That's to let everyone know that there's an emergency. And what else is also used to let everyone know that there's an emergency is the siren. Here we go. Oh, that's so loud. And then also the horn. Yeah. And then the police officer on the motorcycle took the evidence to the police station. inside the evidence room with our evidence. Hey, how are you? Good. Hey, that's the evidence. What do we do? So we're going to process it for prints. Okay, how do we do that? First, you're going to need your lab coat. Ooh, lab coat. Look. Yeah, it's the color blue. Wow, I like the color blue. It's one of my two favorite colors. Blue is one of them, and orange is the other. All right, now I have my lab coat on. Now what? Uh, now you need your gloves. <laughs> Ooh, gloves. Are they? Okay, they're right here, looks like. Ooh, look at these. Blue rubber gloves. So we wear these so then we don't make our own fingerprints on the evidence. All right, so now I have the gloves on. Now what? Now you're going to need to pull this brown paper down. Okay. Whoa, here we go. Thank you. Whoa. <laughs> brown paper. Okay. Right. So, now you can come on over to okay. the side. All right. And now, so we have this, we have the paper right here and gloves on. So now what do you need? Now you're gonna need some tools. Okay, let's see. First of all, you're gonna need your print dust. Ooh, look at that, print dust. It's the color black. Whoa, okay. Next, you're gonna need your brush. Brush, look at that brush. Whoa, <laughs> so now what do I do? So take your glass out of the bag. Okay. 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 Now dip okay. your brush into the dust. Okay. Just a little bit. Okay. I've got some dust, do you see that? Now what? Now paint your brush on your fingerprint like a fairy dancing on the lake. Ooh, fairy dancing on the lake. I like that. You're funny. Okay, here we go. Do, 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 do. All right. Whoa, it's showing something. Wow. All right. Okay, I'll take that. Okay. And next, you're going to need your print lifter. Ooh, a print lifter. So, a print lifter looks like a sticker. So, can you hold this for me? Sure. Okay, so now I'm going to unstick this. And this is really sticky. And then I'm going to put it right here. Whoa. There we go. Oh, okay. And then, should I peel it off? Gently peel it off. Okay. Just like that. Oh, oh, we did it. Wow, okay, let's close it up like a book. And look at that. Wow, we just pulled a print off of the glass. Yeah, the evidence glass. Okay, so I'll give you that, and okay. then what do we do with the glass now? So the glass needs to go back into a paper bag. Okay, so I'll go get a paper bag. Okay. And yeah, here we go. Let's see. Perfect. Here's the paper bag. There we go. Okay. Now what? Now you need to seal the bag with evidence tape. Okay, evidence tape. Oh. Okay, check this out. Evidence tape. Seal it up. All right, it's nice and sealed. Now what? Don't forget to sign it. Oh, gotta sign it. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, let's put the pen back. Now that the evidence is all taped up and secure, we need to put it in the evidence vault. Whoa, here I go! What is 
Lisa. Hello, Flippy. <laughs> hey, I have some evidence for you. Oh, hey. We got the results back of those prints. Oh, whoa. Look at this. It's a photo of a raccoon. So a raccoon ate my lunch. Look at this! This is a fire department helicopter toy! Ooh, and today we're at the Los Angeles City Fire Department Air Operations! And let me tell you, I have a surprise for you! It's a real fire department helicopter! I am so excited to learn about fire department helicopters today with you! Are you ready? Let's go! Woo! Okay, now let's check out the inside of the fire department helicopter. Come on! We have to open up the door. Whoa, do you see in here? This, yeah, is the cab of the helicopter. Come in here. Whoa, there's so many cool things in here. First, let me show you the cockpit. Whoa, look up there. There's so many cool instruments, gadgets, radios. Whoa! <sighs> okay, for now, I'll show you the cab. Ooh, there's a lot of seats in here. See? I'm gonna go to this one. Whoa, hey! The seat has a seat belt. I'm gonna put it on. All right, buckle up. Ooh, you see? I'm in this seat, and there's another seat. There's another seat. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, and there's actually another seat in the back. Yeah, five, you're sitting on it. <laughs> That's funny. Whoa, look at this. Look at this giant backpack. There's a bunch of medical supplies in here. Whoa. This is what they take down to the ground to help people. Ooh, look at this light. Ooh, <laughs> it's the color blue and it's shining on my face. So these light, lights are really dim. So then from there you can use your MVGs, your night vision goggles, and see at night so it doesn't blind you. Ooh, whoa, this is a headset. Wow, you put it on your ears and then has a microphone right here, but I have to plug it in first. Check this out. Get ready, listen. Whoa, can you hear me? <laughs> I sound funny. I'm talking through the microphone right now. Whoa, flying in a helicopter. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'll, I'll show you more of that later. But for now, look at this, this, Whoa, is a med deck. I can pull it out. It's nice and flat. Keeps the spine of the patient nice and flat. Okay, gotta put it back in here. Okay, there we go. Wow, it was so cool seeing the inside of the cap of the helicopter. Whoa, so many cool things. Whoa! Blippi, this is our hook for our rescue hoist. Oh, a hook on the rescue? Wait, wait a second. Who are you? I'm Pilot Sharif. <laughs> what do you do? Well, today I'm the hoist operator on our air ambulance at the LFD Air Operations. Ooh, that's cool. Wait, 
What's in your hand? This is called a pendant. It's what controls our hook. You can lower or raise it with this controller here. Whoa! This is the controller of the hoist. Wow. Can you show me all of this stuff I in sure, action? I sure can. Would you like to try our, our hot seat? This is how we rescue people who really aren't hurt on the ground. <gasps> and a hot, a hot seat? I wonder what a hot seat is. Well, our hot seat oh, looks like a jacket. Go ahead and put your helmet on. Okay. And you already have safety glasses on, so yep. that works. <laughs> Look, I'm wearing a white helmet. This okay. works just like a jacket. Okay. And it's a simple harness that allows us to bring you up into the helicopter safely Ooh. without falling through. Okay, so this is a harness that if I'm on the ground, you hoist down or someone hoists down to come save me, right? That's right. And they help you put this on just like this. Okay. And they'll connect you to the hook once you get down on the ground. Okay. They'll lower the hook down to you and then we'll connect it. Whoa. And when you're ready, we'll bring you up. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Here we go. Whoa! 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 It's like I'm flying! We'll bring you all the way up to the helicopter. Okay. We'll bring you in, and then with me will be safe. Oh, cool! My way. Well, thank you so much for showing me this. Oh, you're welcome. All right. It's nice to meet you, Blippi. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> wow, this is so much fun! <laughs> hey! Wait! Hey! Wait a second! Come back! I'm stuck! Hello? Hey! Oh no! <laughs> hey! Look at me! I'm riding inside the cockpit while the tug tugs the helicopter. <laughs> Just to let you know, helicopters are at airports, and also airplanes are at airports. And if there's ever a problem at an airport, they have a big truck called a foam truck. Oh hey, look, there's a foam truck right over there. Do you see it? Yeah. Okay, so what foam trucks do are they spray foam and water out the front just in case if there's ever anything at the airport a fire. So what we're going to do is show you it's spraying water out of the turret. See? There's the first turret. Whoa! That's so powerful. Are you ready for the second turret? All right, here we go. Whoa! You see that? There's one turret and there's two turrets. Fill up the helicopter with water! Watch! 
much water that came out of that helicopter. Ooh, looks like he's ready. Wow, look at how high they are in the air. Ooh, where's he going? Whoa! <laughs> Look at him dangling from the helicopter! Wow! Hello! Hey! One of them is wearing the color blue! And the other is wearing the color orange! <laughs> My two favorite colors! Ooh! Remember that? That's the hot seat! Okay, here he goes! Whoa! <laughs> that looks fun! Whoa, hello! Wow, he just got hoisted all the way up into the sky in the helicopter! Wow! <laughs> Shut the door! <laughs> Now it's time to learn the exterior parts of the helicopter! Wow, what a big machine! Oh hey! Up here, this is the cockpit. This is where the pilot and the co-pilot sit. So then they fly the helicopter! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> and back here, this is the cab! Yeah, this is where all the passengers sit. And this helicopter is so big that 14 people can be inside here. 14? That is so many people! Whoa! Oh, look at this! This is a spotlight. Ready? <laughs> yeah! Also known as the night sun. This is used to shine so then anyone can, everyone can see everything at night! Whoa, so bright! Ooh, and back here, these, this is a water tank. And you fill it up right here. Grab the hose. <laughs> Bring on the water! Then this fills up with water, and then from there you fly over things. <laughs> and you pour water on things, like Fires, so then you can save people. Wow, what a cool machine. Let's see what else there is. Come on. Whoa, look down there. Wait a second. What's this doing here? Huh, you know how some helicopters have landing skids? This helicopter has wheels and tires. Wow, that is so interesting. Huh, cool. Ooh. Whoa! Wait a second! You've seen this before, right? Yeah, this is a number! Yeah, one, two, three! The number three! Wow! Oh, let's open this up! Whoa! Check it out! That's a cargo compartment! It's pretty dark in there. <laughs> Come on! Oh, hey! Los Angeles Fire Department. Oh, they're pretty cool. <laughs> Whoa! Wow, this is a horizontal stabilizer fin. It keeps the helicopter stable. Oh, look up there! That's the tail rotor! Whoa! <laughs> it's so high up there! And this, it looks pretty big, but in reality, that's the smaller rotor. But this one, the main rotor, come here! It is so big! You see it up there? Whoa! This main rotor has five blades. One, Two, three, four, five! Good job! 
Whoa, it's so high up there! Oh, <laughs> anyways, I was just trying to touch it. <laughs> Whoa, look at this! The exhaust! All the exhaust from the jet engine gets pushed out of there. Wait a second, I just said jet engine. Yeah, look! Whoa! That's the jet engine. There's two of them on this helicopter. One on this side and one on the other. This is where it produces all of its power. And one of the places that it uses its power is the transmission. Whoa! That is so cool looking up there. Oh hey! Look at this! You see right here? This is where you refuel the helicopter. We won't mess with that. Okay, let's see what else we have here. Ooh, ha! Huh? Check out my sweet dance moves. <laughs> okay, anyways, look at this. This is the hoist. Whoa, it goes down. Yeah, about 300 feet roughly. <laughs> that is so much. And then it can save people by going. So much for learning about the exterior parts of the helicopter with me. <laughs> Yeehaw! Now it's time for the firefighting helicopter song. videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Alright, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I! -I. Flippy! Good job! Alright, bye-bye! Whoa! Look
look at this fire truck toy. It has a gigantic ladder. There's a real fire truck behind me. Let's put this fire truck toy away and check out some of the gadgets on the real fire truck. Can you hear me? This is Fireman Blippy. <laughs> hey, we're inside a real fire truck. I got my seatbelt on to keep me safe. I even got my headset so I can communicate with all the other workers. Oh, look over this way. That's where the driver sits and steers the fire truck with the steering wheel. Oh, check the back out with me. Yeah, look at all those seats. That's where the rest of the fire workers sit. And there's anywhere from three to six firemen in the fire truck going to the fire. <laughs> Let's check out some more of the fire truck. the base of the ladder on the fire truck and look way up there. Yeah, there's a real fireman. Let's get him to wave to us. Oh, he's so high up there. He's about 105 feet up in the air. Wow! Now it's about time for me to show you some of the tools and gadgets on a fire truck. Let's go. Whoa. Look, this right here, yeah, this is a hydrant wrench. You use this to open up the fire hydrant. And then uh, this is the stores wrench. Whoa, you use the stores wrench on the inlets of the fire truck. So then you can connect the hose to the fire truck and provide the fire truck with water. But in order to do that, you need hoses. Look up here. Whoa. That's a lot of hose. Okay. Now, let me show you some more cool gadgets of the fire truck. Whoa, watch this. Whoa! Okay, we got a pickaxe. We got just a normal pick. And then, yep, you can't forget the snippers. <laughs> Ooh, watch this trick. Whoa! Look at all these cool tools on the fire truck. <laughs> There's tools inside secret compartments that are inside secret compartments. <laughs> Wait, hey, come back here. I forgot to show you something. Look at inside this little compartment. Whoa, it's a giant air tank. The firefighters use this to breathe air because you can't breathe in fire and smoke. But in order to use this, you need to wear a harness. Let's go try on a harness now. <laughs> We 
just got a fire call. Let's go put on our air pack. All right, this is our air pack. This is compressed air in this big bottle. And then this down here, this is my mask. So let me put it on. Tighten that up. And then you just buckle this in kind of like a seat belt. Okay, and now you gotta turn on the air. Okay, and then let's put on the mask. Okay, now I'm breathing air from the air condenser pack back there. Now it's time to go fight some fires. See ya! the buttons. <laughs> this fire truck toy is so much fun. Thank you for learning about fire trucks with me, Blippi. B L I P-P-I, Blippi. Good job, now you know how to say and spell my name. If you wanna see more of my fun educational videos, be sure to click this big red button that says subscribe so you can see all of them. Or if you wanna see me play with this fire truck toy more, be sure to click that. So then you can see my brand new channel where I play with toys. <laughs> wow, this is gonna be fun. Parents, if your child loves my videos, be sure to head over to blippy.com because as you know now, they can watch my videos for free on YouTube, but introducing, they can download them on their tablet, phone, or your tablet, or your phone, <laughs> and not use your data or your Wi-Fi just in case if you're going on a long trip. <laughs> Who knows? All right, well, see you again. Thanks for watching. Bye. Come. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And I was just making some sweet tunes with this bowl. And <laughs> <laughs> you like that? <laughs> That's funny. But hey, today, we're not gonna learn about tunes. We're gonna learn about, yeah, how to make clay. Yeah, look at it. Look at how many cool colors I have. Whoa, look. <laughs> so much fun to play with. Whoa, and you can roll it up and make things with it. Look, I just made a baseball. <laughs> wow, all right, let's look at all the colors we have. Orange, white, blue, purple, green, red, black, and light blue. Whoa! And today, yeah, you and I are gonna make some of this. 
Yeah, and this recipe you can make at home with a grown-up. Yeah, and then after you make it, you can squish it nice and flat, and then you take some of these and and then you can cut it out. Whoa! And maybe we can spell some words together. Maybe we can make an airplane together. Whoa! This is going to be so much fun. Okay, so the first thing we have to do is have all the ingredients for this clay. Yeah, here we go. And I have my recipe right here. <laughs> first, we need a bowl. And what I would do if I was you, I would probably have a grown-up help you because this can get really messy and there's a lot of ingredients. Yeah, all right. So first, we need to start with one cup of flour. Whoa. Okay, let's open this up. There we go. And it doesn't need to be exact. Yeah, that is one cup of flour. Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> wow. That is a great base for the clay we're making. Okay. All right. Let's see. One quarter cup of salt. All right. It is definitely already getting really messy. Okay. One quarter cup. And then we need to grab some salt. Here we go. Perfect. Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa. Perfect. All right. Okay. Let me zip this back up. Yeah. And then we need one teaspoon of cream of tartar. <laughs> what a silly name. <laughs> That's so fun. Cream of tartar. One teaspoon. Oh, there's so many. Okay, here we go. Here's one. Here we go. And we're gonna mix all this up in a little bit. But for now, oh, let's pour all the ingredients in here. Then we have a half a tablespoon of oil. Okay, whoa. This is where it might get a little messy. Okay. Perfect. All right, put the lid back on, just so it does not spill. That would be bad news, Barry. <laughs> okay, and then we have a half cup of H2O. Do you know what H2O stands for? Yeah. Water. <laughs> I love water. All right, half of a cup. Perfect. All right. Oh, hey, look. I forgot to close up the flour. You should probably do that. All right, let's push all that stuff to the side because now we're ready to mix it up. But what we need to do is put in some color. And you can make any color you want. But what we're gonna do Although we already have a green color, I think we should make another green. But this one will be a little bit lighter. So let's open this up, add some green. I don't know how much to add, but that seems like quite a bit. And then also I'm gonna add a little bit of yellow. Yeah, it's gonna make it more of a, a bright green. Close that up. Whoa, that was a fun recipe to make. But now, <laughs> I gotta mix it up. Whoa, it's looking so good. <laughs> wow. You see it? Whoa, all right, let me keep mixing it up. Wow, check it out. Wow, whoa, homemade clay. Wow, what a pretty green color we made. Good job. I wonder what color you're gonna make at home for your first color. 
So now what you can do with this, it's so much fun. You can actually smash it flat. Watch this trick. <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh, <laughs> that's silly. Okay, let's peel it off. Wow, perfect. And then, now you can use these. Yeah, they're like cookie cutters. But these are definitely not cookies that we're making. I would not eat this, okay? All right, okay. Uh, yeah, remember that airplane? Whoa! Yeah, check it out. Okay, now you push it down. Whoa, look, <laughs> cut an airplane out. But first, let's push it out of here. Wow. Yeah, we did such a good job. Wow, okay, I'll put that airplane right there. Now, let's bring all the colors that we have out. And then, let's see what we can make together. Okay, so let's put that green back. And we have the airplane right there. What else? Oh, we have some letters. We have, ooh, a dog. Woof, woof. Will you act like a dog with me? Ready? Woof! 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 <laughs> wow! <laughs> Dogs are so cute. Okay, let's make a blue dog. That sounds pretty silly, doesn't it? Okay, you know what to do. Smash out your clay nice and flat. Oh, <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, push it down. All right, whoa, look at that. Whoa, pull the sides away. Wow, and now, oh, <laughs> that's silly. Look, what is that? Yeah, it's a little poochie. <laughs> Okay, we'll save you. We'll put you right there. Perfect. All right. One pooch and one airplane. Huh? <laughs> Perfect. Oh, hey, I think we have some letters over here. We can spell something out. Okay. Looks like we have a B, a P, an I, an L. Huh. A B, a P, an I and an L. What word can you think that uses those letters? A B, a P, an I, and an L. Hmm. I know! Yeah, my name! <laughs> Blippi! Yeah, we can actually spell my whole name out just with these four letters. See, we would go like this. We would use a B, an L, an I, we would do two P's, and then we would use another I. Perfect. All right, let's do that. All right, first we need some colors. So let's use this blue color. Yeah, there we go. Let's do a B right there. Perfect. Whoa, this is gonna be so cool. Yeah. And if you use some of this at home, maybe you could spell your name. Okay, let's use some purple. All right, so we've got a blue B right here. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, and then we have an L. All right, nice little L right there. Yeah. So a B, L, and then we need an I. How does that look? Yeah. Whoa. Okay. B, 
L I. Yeah. B L I. What's the next letter? Yeah, P. And there's two of them. Let's use one of my favorite two colors. Yeah, the color orange. B L I P. We need another P. We'll use the color black. <laughs> this is so much fun. And it feels so cool on my hands. Ooh, another P. Yeah. So we got, here we go. We got B L I P P. What's the next letter? B L I P P. Yeah, I. And let's use this bright red color. All right, here we go. B L I P P I. Here we go. Oh, how does that look? B L I P P I. Yeah, good job. All right. Okay, let's put these down here with the dog and the airplane. There we go. All right. Now, let's make one more thing. Huh. Hey, well, since we had all these stencils and these cookie cutters, yeah, you could actually use a lot of them. You can make a star. You can make a heart. You could make, ooh, a butterfly. Yeah. Or you could use some other tools. Yeah, like this spoon or this fork. And see, look at this. See, you can use the fork and, yeah, act like you're in the garden. Do, 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 do. Yep, gotta make the soil nice and soft so then you can plant some plants. Wow. <laughs> but I am definitely making a mess with all these small pieces, so look at this. This is a cool trick that I learned. See? You can actually pick up a lot of the pieces by smashing it. Yeah, it's kind of fun, huh? <laughs> okay, but watch this. Hey, we haven't used this color green yet. So, if you take the spoon and you scoop it, although it's a half of a circle, we go all the way around, you actually might be able to scoop a full circle. Okay, let's try it. Ready? Yeah, look, there we go. Whoa, look, <laughs> it's like a circle. Wow, <laughs> and then you can put it in your hands, roll it around. Yeah, look, <laughs> it's like a basketball. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was silly. <laughs> well, this has been so much fun making this clay with you. Did you have fun making clay with me? Yeah! And it was really fun, yeah, using those cookie cutters to cut out some of the clay into an airplane. Yeah. A doggy. Woof, 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 woof. <laughs> and my name, Blippi. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B oh, L I P P I Blippi. All right. Thank you so much for being my friend. See you soon. Bye bye. Oh, hey, it's me, Blippi. Do you see what I'm doing? I'm painting. Yeah, I'm actually painting just a regular cardboard box. Check it out. See, I took this cardboard box and I'm painting it. Do you know what I'm painting and making? I'm actually gonna make a lemonade stand. Yeah, I love lemonade. It's so yummy. But a lemonade stand 
isn't used just to drink your own lemonade. It's so then you can sell lemonade to others. <laughs> yeah. So the first thing that you have to do is make a very good looking lemonade stand so then everyone will want to come try your lemonade. So now that it's all painted, I have these yellow triangle ribbons. <laughs> and if I put them on here on the top, it will spark some more customers. <laughs> okay, let's put some tape right here. There we go. Wow. All right. You see these yellow triangles? Yeah. What is the color yellow that you can think of? Lemonade! <laughs> also, the sun is the color yellow. Okay, there we go. And then we actually have a little bit more of this. Wow. Have you ever tried lemonade before? It's really tasty. It's weird because if you just eat a normal lemon, it's really sour. Oh. <laughs> but if you add a lot of water and then some sugar, it'll sweeten it right up and make a nice refreshing drink. Okay. How about right there? Whoa, it looks so good. All right, we have our lemonade stand, blue and orange, my two favorite colors. We added the yellow banners to bring in more customers, but all these customers are gonna be like, what's Blippi doing? <laughs> so we need to tell them what we're doing. We're gonna be selling lemonade, $1. <laughs> So let's put this right here. Perfect. How does this look? Can you tell what I'm here for? Yeah, to sell lemonade. All right, now that we built the stand, now we need to make some lemonade and then we can sell it. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> yeah, the first ingredient to lemonade is lemons. <laughs> there we go. So great that our friend has their very own lemon tree. That definitely saves us a lot of money when we calculate how much this lemonade cost us to make. Okay. All right. See this pitcher? We're going to put a lot of water, sugar, lemons, and we're going to spice it up with a little bit of raspberries to make raspberry lemonade. So the first thing that we need to do is to grab our lemons. Yeah, all right. And only grown-ups should use a knife. So we're going to first take a lemon. We're gonna cut it in half and use this device to squeeze out all of the juice, just like this. Ready? Wow. <laughs> yeah, do you see all that lemon juice down there? Okay, let's do another. There we go. Whoa, this thing is just pressing out all of the juice. Oh, it looks so yummy. <laughs> I bet it'd be really sour though. <laughs> all right, I think that is plenty of lemon juice for our lemonade. All right, so we need to now pour this in our giant pitcher. There we go. <laughs> All right, it has a little bit of pulp, but that's okay. Okay, so the lemons were free. So this cost us zero dollars to make. <laughs> we're right on track. Okay, the next thing, let's add our water. Okay. Whoa. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> oh, that 
that's a perfect amount. Okay. So the lemons were free. The water was 10 cents. Yeah. And now we need to sweeten it up. Because this is basically just like watered down lemon juice, which would be really tart and sour. <laughs> so what we have right here is sugar. Yeah, that's a really tasty ingredient. You don't want to eat too much sugar though. But for the lemonade, we're going to add six scoops. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> there we go. Let's put that aside. Here we go. <laughs> Woohoo! This lemonade is complete. All you really need to make lemonade are lemons, water, and sugar. But we have that extra ingredient from earlier, remember? Raspberries. Yeah, we're gonna make raspberry lemonade. But before we add those, let's calculate how much this lemonade has cost us thus far. Well, the lemons were free because we have a great friend. <laughs> the water was 10 cents and then the sugar was 40 cents. So right now we're at 50 cents for this whole pitcher. Whoa, all right. Now we can add our raspberries. Woo, oh, oh, that's silly, one fell out. I'm not gonna touch it. I'm gonna just use these. Ready? Here we go. Whoa, looks like they float. Whoa, raspberry lemonade. <laughs> okay, so now our total cost, let's calculate. So earlier it was 50 cents and these raspberries cost me 50 cents from the grocery store. So 50 cents plus 50 cents is $1. Wow, this whole pitcher cost us $1. All right, let's put in some ice <laughs> to chill it down so then we can go and sell it. The ice was free because our friend also has a freezer full of ice. So now that we have nice cold lemonade, raspberry lemonade, we can go and sell it. I think there's about eight cups in here and our cost is $1. So eight cups, if we sell them for $1 would be $8. And if we minus $1, that's $7. Whoa, we're gonna make $7. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, we did it. We built this amazing lemonade stand. We made some tasty lemonade. Yeah, now it's time to sell some lemonade. Here we go. Lemonade, lemonade. Who wants some lemonade? Oh, I'd love some lemonade. Oh, okay. How are you doing today? Good, I'm a little thirsty. Ooh, really? Well, it looks like I might have something just for you. Oh, fantastic. How here. much is it? It is one dollar. One dollar. I got that right here. <gasps> Thank you, what kind is this? This is not normal lemonade. It is raspberry lemonade, my favorite. I can't wait to try, thank you. All right, see you later. Bye. Did you see that? You and I just made our very first lemonade sale. Good job. <laughs> well, this has been so much fun learning about business, how to make lemonade with you, and having fun along the way. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, time to sell some more lemonade. <laughs> lemonade, lemonade, who wants some lemonade? <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi, and look at all the items that I have. Whoa, so many random things. But hey, in this video, we are going to do the Blippi Velocity Race. Yeah, that's where we put a lot of these items on this ramp. Yeah, see how this ramp is at an angle? Yeah, we're gonna let them go at the same time and see what item reaches the bottom first. Okay, so let's go with 
heat number one, the slow pokes. <laughs> we have this sweet, colorful beach ball, and then we have this really light balloon. Okay, all right. What one do you think is gonna reach the bottom first? I think I know. Three, two, one. Whoa, did you see that? Yeah, the beach ball went to the bottom first. Okay, let's let them just, you know, get warmed up for later. And then we'll use some more items. Yeah, I'm sure all these items are gonna be a lot faster. Okay, here's another set of items. They're actually the same item. Water bottles. Yeah, but this one is empty. And this one is half full. <laughs> All right, let's put them on their side and then let's let them roll down. Okay, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. Awesome. Three, two, one. Whoa! Yeah! Wow! The half full water bottle totally beat the empty water bottle. How do you feel after your race, half full water bottle? Oh, Blippi, I feel amazing. I can't believe I've won. Great. Well, it's going to move on to the next race. Half full water bottle versus extremely bright orange duct tape. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Are you ready? Ready to race. Are you ready? You know I'm ready. All right, three, two, one. Whoa, whoa, did you see that? Yeah, the water bottle rolled down way to the bottom, way quick, way faster than the duct tape. Perfect, so now it can move on to the next round. Have you ever wondered why these items, some go fast? and some go slow? Yeah, it's because their velocity, yeah, velocity is basically the speed at which they're rolling down, the speed and the direction. Yeah, there's a lot of things that actually determine what the item's velocity is. I mean, like, think about it like this. There could be a lot of friction and it like can't slide or maybe it rolls compared to you know maybe there's sharp edges there's just so many things that you know determine how fast how much velocity these items have so let's let these two items go we have orange over here and apple over here and let's see who wins Go! Whoa! They were actually really close to each other. I don't even know who won. Let's see that instant replay. Whoa! That was awesome! All right, let's pick two more items we have. A soccer ball or a football, depends where you live, and the half full water bottle, the champion. Okay, let's see who wins. All right, here we go. Are you ready? I'm good to go. Are you ready? I was born ready. All right, and away we go. Whoa! I cannot believe it! The half full water bottle wins the velocity race! Woohoo! And the crowd goes wild! <laughs> wow, that was awesome learning about velocity and how fast that water bottle went and how the ramp is angled. But yeah, if the ramp was flat, it definitely wouldn't go anywhere, right? Yeah! Hey, can you think of a machine that is actually really fast? Yeah, there's a lot of them. Okay, let me give you a hint. Okay, this machine does not go on the ground. Well, it does, but then it goes in the air. Yeah. Whoa, I hear one. Yeah, maybe you've got to fly in one before. Fly? Yeah, they fly in the air. Yeah, 
airplanes. Yeah, airplanes are really fast. And speaking of speed and velocity, I think you and I should watch the airplane video. about velocity with you and it was really fun seeing all these great items compete at the great blippy velocity race <laughs> but there's only one champion and today that was water <laughs> wow <laughs> well this is the end of this video but if you want to watch more of my videos all you have to do is search for my name will you spell my name with me B L I P-P-I, Blippi, good job. All right, see you again, bye-bye. <laughs>
And to make it even, we need to add the carrying case on this side too. Okay, now let's see if all these feathers weigh more or less than this rock. Ready? Oh, that one rock is heavier than all of these feathers. Whoa. Whoa, that is so cool. Okay, let me put that rock over there. Put this back up here. Wow. We have to stay nice and clean and organized because we have a lot of things to weigh here. Hey, all right. Hey, check these out. What kind of fruit are these? Do you know? Yeah, this one is an apple. And this one is an orange. Yum! <laughs> I love fruit, and I love vegetables. Okay, let's see, huh, they weigh roughly the same. I wonder what one's gonna be heavier, what one's gonna be lighter. Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa, do you see that? Yeah. The apple is heavier. Wow, <laughs> and it's bigger, but that isn't always the case. Remember? Yeah, the feathers were so big, and then the rock was so small. But the feathers, yeah, were lighter than the rock. So it's all about density. Yeah, let's see here. Ooh, look at these. <laughs> wow, these are cubes, and they actually are pretty, whoa, <laughs> light. <laughs> wow. See, even one barely even tipped the scale. Okay, so let's go like this. Okay, there are four on that side. Actually, let's do three. <laughs> okay, now the same cubes on this side. Let's do five. What one do you think will be heavier? Yeah, you're right. Five cubes of the same size and same weight is heavier than three cubes of the same size and weight. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, all right, let's get back to weighing things. Okay, let's put these rocks over here. Let's gather up all the feathers. We need to pick up after ourselves. Perfect, put those right over there. <laughs> Although they're so cute and pretty. Okay, all right, now we have some dinosaurs. <laughs> we have a T-Rex. <laughs> okay, you can stand right there. Oh, how about you just take a nap? Just like that. <laughs> and then we have a Triceratops. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see what toy weighs more. I don't know the actual dinosaur weight, but just for these toys, yeah, this T-Rex is heavier than the Triceratops, but what if we added a Brontosaurus to it? All right, are you ready? These are definitely heavier. <laughs> okay, we'll put those aside. All right, now we have an experiment. Okay, we have rice and we have water. So let's put the same amount of rice in a balloon compared to the water, the same amount. So let's do a quarter of a cup. And then we can see what one is heavier, which means which one is more dense because they're actually gonna be roughly the, the no, they will be the, the same size, yeah. Because one quarter of a cup is volume. Perfect, all right. <laughs> Sometimes it can be so confusing. <laughs> okay, all right, one quarter of a cup. Make sure it's nice and... What? Perfect. Okay, oh, gotta set that down right here. Need to prep my balloon first. Perfect, there we go. Okay, gotta use the funnel or else it would be really dirty. <laughs> okay, here we go. One quarter cup. Let me tie it. 
Okay, now I'll do the water. All right. Okay, now we need one quarter of a cup of water. Whoa. I don't want to spill. Ready? Ah, perfect. <laughs> okay. Stay nice and organized. Be sure to clean up. All right, now let me tie this. Okay, so we use the same amount of volume. One quarter cup of rice, one quarter cup of water. Okay, now we get to do the fun part. We get to put it on the scale, and we get to see which one is more dense. Which one is heavier? Ready? Yeah, the blue was rice. Whoa, rice is more dense than water. Whoa! Do you know what else is really heavy? Yeah! Construction vehicles are really heavy. Yeah, like this excavator or this front loader. Whoa! Huh. This excavator is actually heavier than this front loader toy. Whoa! <laughs> hey, I have an idea. Since we're talking about weight and machines, are really, really, really heavy. Let me think about a machine that is very heavy, low to the ground, and can push everything out of its way. Do you know what machine that is? Yeah, look at the big front blade on it. Yeah, that is a bulldozer. Hey, I think we should learn and watch the bulldozer video. <laughs> bulldozer, clearing the land. Whoa. Pushing rubble and sand oh, oh, oh. Bulldozer Constructing the roads oh, oh, oh. Move over, it's about to roll It's a yellow tracked machine oh, oh, oh. Found on mines, farms, and factories oh, oh, oh. It can push most anything oh, oh, oh. Bulldozer stirring up debris Bulldozers help the farmers work By breaking up Rocks and digging in the dirt With the blade on the front And the claw on the back It can help you build a home Just like that Whoa, it's on a roll Bulldozer And they can move through some rough terrain They can move all kinds of things Bulldozer, clearing the land Pushing rubble and sand oh, oh, oh. Bulldozer Constructing the roads oh, oh, oh. Move over, it's about to roll Bulldozer Clearing the land oh, oh, oh. Bulldozer Pushing rubble and sand oh, oh, oh. Bulldozer Constructing the roads oh, oh, oh. Move over, it's about to roll Roll, roll on Bulldozer it's a yellow machine Roll, roll on bulldozer Better move over, here comes the bulldozer It's a yellow machine Ring, ring! Alright, <laughs> put in the box, here we go! Go to the other side, dump them out! There we go! Two more blocks on this side! Hmm, let's see... Maybe the rock will make it heavy enough. Whoa! It for sure was heavy enough. Wow, that was so much fun learning about weight with you. And also, bulldozers. Wow, those machines are so heavy. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again.
Bye bye. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna clean up now. Oh, hey, it's me, Flippy. And today, I'm at Chase Field. Yeah, this giant building, it's a baseball stadium. And this is the Diamondback Stadium. <laughs> and today, you and I are gonna learn about baseball. Come on. Watch your step. Oh, whoa. Oh, wow. Whoa. <laughs> whoa. Hey, check it out. This is the dugout. This is where players hang out before it's their turn. You have to wait your turn. Whoa. Look. <laughs> Let's clean off our shoes. <laughs> okay, come on. Whoa. Look at this place. It's so beautiful. Whoa, and look up top. Whoa, do you see the roof? One side is closed and one side is open. They can close it if they want shade and they can open it if they want sun. Pretty cool. Oh, come here. Whoa, look at this. This is a giant camera. Hello, <laughs> hello. This camera is used to be able to see all the players really far away. The players in the outfield. The outfield. Whoa, look how far away it is. Whoa. And then the infield. Whoa, that's a lot of cool dirt. And over here. This is the batting circle. Whoa. This is where the players warm up and bat. Hi, Blippi. Hey. I'm Luis Gonzalez. Whoa. Luis Gonzalez? Do you play baseball? I used to play baseball. Now I win baseball. Oh, he win baseball. <laughs> Will you teach me some tips and tricks? Sure, let's go. OK, come on. OK, back to the dugout. Whoa. Pretty cool. Well, Blippi, to play baseball, you need a bat. Ooh, a bat. Check it out. <laughs> Pretty cool. And a helmet. Ooh, a helmet. Sweet. All right. A ball. Ooh, a baseball. Wow. And a glove. Ooh, and a glove. Ooh, pretty cool. Now what? Now let's go to the sandlot so you can play baseball. All right, let's go. You? Whoa! Whoa! What is this place? Well, Blippi, this is our sandlot. This is where we're going to teach you how to hit. Ooh! This is the sandlot, he said. It's a small version of the baseball field, and I'm going to learn how to hit. Okay. Are you ready? Yep. Oh, what do I do here? This is a T. Okay, a T. Huh. Now you grip the bat. Okay. No, not that way, Blippi. Okay. This way. Oh, okay. Put your hands together. All right. And now. Yeah, check it out. <laughs> we put a ball uh -huh. on the tee. Okay. For you to hit. Okay, here we go. Whoa. <laughs> okay, let me try again. Okay, put the helmet back on. Keep your eye on the ball, Blippi. Okay. Eye on the ball. Whoa! Yeah! Home run! <laughs> okay, that was so much fun. Thank Lippy, you. Looks like you're ready to play catch now. Ooh, catch. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. The mitt, the glove. Okay. Uh, let's take this off and let's put this on. No, okay. Blippi. The glove goes on your hand. Oh. Love goes on my hand, oh yeah. <laughs> okay, all right, here we go. I'm you ready. ready. Yep. Okay, go out there. Okay. All right, 
ready? Ready? Whoa! Oh, I missed! <laughs> okay, what did I do wrong? You have to try to catch the ball in your glove. Oh, the ball goes in the glove. Okay, all right, let's try again. Ready? Yep. Nice! Oh, yeah! I did it! Whoa! That was awesome! Thank you so much for teaching me! Blippi, looks like you're ready for the big leagues. Oh, the big leagues? What does that mean? Where do I go? To the big field. Let's go to the cage and get ready. All right, let's go! <laughs> Whoa! What is this thing? Hey, Blippi, this is the pitching machine. Ooh, the pitching machine? What does it do? It teaches you how to bat. Ooh, teaches you how to bat. How does it work? You put the ball in the machine. Whoa, that was cool. Will you do it again? Sure. Whoa, did you see that? When you put the ball right here, these spinny things throw it out really fast. And then, what do I do? You gotta go hit. <gasps> okay. Okay, Blippi, here we go. Good job. Yeah! Oh. Oh. Yeah! That's like a home run! You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Get it. Yeah, get it. Whoa! That was awesome! <laughs> Great job, Lippy. Yeah, thank you so much. You're ready for the big leagues. Woohoo! Alright, now what? Now it's time for cleanup. Clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up. Clean up, clean up. That sounds fun. <laughs> Clean up, clean up, clean up your stuff. Clean Whoa! Up, clean I up, hit so many baseballs! Okay, it's really important to be nice and organized and stay clean. And pick up after yourself. Whoa! Clean up, clean up, clean up your stuff. Your room looks quite a mess. Whoa! Look at all of these balls! That was so much fun! I kinda wanna clean up again! Things and clean your room. Whoa! Hey, did you see that? That says the Sandlot. Oh, and check it out. The Sandlot is a place where kids just like you can play at the Diamondbacks game. Whoa! Whoa! This is awesome. Oh, hey, look. There's a Bobcat right here. Hello, Bobcat. Meow. Meow. <laughs> Ooh, and it's a slide. Check it out. Whoa! All right, here we go! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, that was fun! I wanna do it again! Whoa, all right, here we go! Whoa, this is cool! Here we go! Whoa! Whoa, and look! While playing, you can even watch the baseball game! Hello down there! Hello! Oh, that's awesome! Whoa, what is this? Whoa. Hello! <laughs> hey, what are you doing down there? Look, it's a baseball mitt. Yeah, a glove. Whoa. I got the ball. Whoa. <laughs> I'm going to crawl through now. Hello. Hey, this is so much fun. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Gee, I am getting so tired with all this plane! Whoa. Whoa. Do you see what I see? Come here! Look! There's a bobcat over there! <laughs> Let's go meet it! Whoa! I am so excited! A real bobcat! Come on! Whoa! 
Oh, look! Hey! How are you? I want a hug! Whoa! This is Baxter, and Bax Baxter is the mascot for the Diamondbacks. Whoa! And what are you? Oh, this is a bobcat! Are you a bobcat? No! Meow! Ah. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, is this your house, Baxter? Whoa, it's really cool! Check it out! Whoa, what's this? Whoa, it's Baxter's mouse! Hello, where are you? Oh, I guess it's not here right now. Ooh, is the mouse your pet? Ooh, <laughs> that's pretty cool. Do you feed it cheese? <laughs> Mice love cheese! Whoa, speaking of food, check it out! Is this your fridge? Ooh, this is Baxter's fridge. What's your favorite thing to eat in here? Whoa! <laughs> wow! Yummy fish! So, fish, Baxter's mouth! Whoa! <laughs> That's silly! Ooh, and here's a door right here. Ooh, does this go inside to your house? Whoa, pretty cool. Oh, it's locked. <laughs> hey, let me ask you a question. Do you like to dance? <laughs> awesome! Can I teach you the baseball dance? Okay, all right. So you act like you grab a bat, okay? And then you just dance! <laughs> yeah! Good job, Baxter! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! What is this? Whoa. This is your bicycle? Whoa! This is Baxter's bicycle! This is really cool! Can you show me how to ride it? Okay! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Okay! Whoa! Whoa! Look at Baxter ride! Whoa! Okay, see you later! Bye bye! Whoa! Hey! Whoa! Check out these seats! Whoa! There's so many seats in this stadium! Hey! I have an idea! Why don't we count them? Okay, let's start down here. Okay, let's count this row of seats. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. Whoa, that's a lot of seats in this row. Okay, to find the total number of seats in this whole stadium, you just take this row and multiply it by the total amount of rows. Okay, let's see. Whoa, okay, it looks like there's 48,618 seats in this stadium. Yep, that's right, that's a lot of seats! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Baseball fields are so cool! Whoa, come here! That's a lot of grass! Whoa! Hey! Do you know one food that every baseball game has? <laughs> I'll show you. Yeah, it's over here. Oh, yeah, popcorn. Whoa, look at all of this popcorn. Whoa. Okay, let's go enjoy the game. Whoa, hey, I have another thing to show you. Come over here. Whoa. This is the Fox Sports Arizona set. Whoa. So cool. 
This is where they do their show at. Oh, look, a camera. Oh, hey, come over here. Whoa. Hey! Hi What's there. your name? My name's Kate Longworth. Ooh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So what do you do? I'm a reporter. I go down and talk to the baseball players and then put it on TV so folks at home can see what they're doing. Whoa, what's that thing? This is a microphone. When I talk in here, it helps people at home hear me. Ooh, hello! Can you hear me? <laughs> and even when you whisper, they can hear you. Hello! Can you hear me? <laughs> Oh, that's silly. Well, cool. Thanks for showing me your spot. Yeah, anytime. Stop by our desk and uh, I'll send you down to interview some players. <gasps> Ooh, cool. Hi. Hi, Mom. <laughs> okay, here. Come over here. Whoa. Look at this. A giant camera. Hey, what's your name? My name is Rusty. What do you do? I'm a cameraman. Ooh. I take videos of Kate and I take videos of the players when they're playing. Oh, really? <laughs> Here's a little tip. Be really nice to him because he'll make you look good. Oh, did you hear that? That's silly. Well, cool. Thanks for showing us your really cool camera, Rusty. Anytime. All right. Whoa, here's another person. Whoa, hello. Hey, what do you do? I'm in charge of our social media network, so everything they do on TV, we try to put on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and Instagram. Whoa, that's really cool. Hey, look, he's on his phone on the job. That's a no-no, unless you're him. <laughs> All right, nice to meet you. Oh, look, there's people up there. Whoa, there's so many people watching us film right now. Must be pretty nerve wracking being on camera all the time. Well, it was in the beginning, but if you practice, it's really fun and you're not scared at all. Oh, okay. Practice makes perfect, I guess. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. It's like a miniature dog park here. Oh. Chase Field even has a place for dogs. <laughs> hey, you wanna come in and meet Sadie? Whoa, come on in. Whoa, hey, are you Sadie? Hi, Sadie. Whoa, did you see how high Sadie jumped? Hey, Sadie, I'm Blippi. How are you? Are you having fun? Yeah, what's your name? Sarah. Ooh, this is Sarah and Sadie. Both of them start with the letter S. <laughs> okay, let's see you run around, Sadie. Okay. Whoa! 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 Oh, that's a really big jump! Whoa, good job, Sadie! Yeah! Oh, yes, can I say hello? Whoa! Hello! Oh, baseball is so cool! Ooh, and this is really cool. This stadium even has a pool over there and a hot tub. Whoa, you can sit in these and watch the game. Whoa, it is so hot here in Arizona. Oh, hey, let's put our feet in the pool and cool down. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa, check it out. Look at the field. Look at how green the grass is. Oh, and there's people out there watering the grass. Hello! <laughs> Whoa. Okay, follow me. Whoa, I am so excited. <laughs> I am so warm. This is gonna feel so good. Okay, first, let's take off our shoes. One shoe. And here, is the second shoe. Check it out. One, two, because I have two feet. All right, okay. Oh, one stinky sock, two stinky socks. Ooh, <laughs> because I have two stinky feet. <laughs> All right, let's roll up my pants. Perfect. Okay, now let's take a dip. Oh, oh yes. Oh, yeah, this feels so good. Oh, I hope someone hits a home run. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Hey, <laughs> check it out. This is a bullpen cart. It's pretty sweet, huh? Yeah, you can take players out to the field with these cars and the stadium is so big, you can even get around with them super fast. 
All right, I gotta go get Dr. Evil now. I was just watching the players warm up. Whoa, pretty cool. Hey, check it out. Whoa, playground. This stadium rocks. Whoa, come on. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, look. Whoa, we're so high in the air. What a great view. All right, now let me go down the slide. Okay, here I go. Whee! Whoa! Oh, hey, I'm just waiting for a churro dog. It's their specialty. Here you go, Flippy, enjoy. Ooh, thank you. Oh, check it out. It looks so yummy. Okay, let's go take a seat. Whoa. Whoa, check it out. They're warming up. Okay, let's take a seat. Oh, this seat looks good. All right. Whoa, look. The roof is closed. Remember earlier? It was open? Yeah. And all the players are warming up. Okay, this is the perfect time to try the churro dog. Oh, oh yum! Whoa! That's so good. This is gonna be fun. Are you having fun? Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Hey, I'm on the field, and look at who's here! Whoa! A bunch of my friends! Wow! They're all so nice for coming! Hello! Some of them are even dressed like me! This is so cool! Whoa! Okay, I'm about to throw the first pitch. I need to put on my jersey. How do I look? <laughs> yeah, check it out. Okay, all right, we need to get ready. This is the exact ball I'm gonna throw. I don't know where to go. You gotta warm up. Do I look pretty good? <laughs> I'm, I'm so nervous. I hope I make it all the way to the catcher. That was really good. Ooh, Baxter's gonna catch the ball. Okay, here we go. This is our time to shine.
learning about baseball with you. Did you have a lot of fun? Yeah, I did too. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> all right. B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>